What's going on everybody? Welcome to today's video. Today, like I promised, I'm back with the one and only Max. Okay, of there we go. There we go. A little delay there. But anyways, <laughs> we're back. Um, he was actually originally going to help me with the official first taste test, but he was not available as always because he was probably doing something more important. Still but, true. yep. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we've got the uh, French Vanilla Ice G Fuel Coffee right here. And basically, we're going to be trying it in milk. We did try a little bit of it in milk, but I wouldn't say that's an official milk tasting taste test rating. Because we only had like half a scoop yeah. and it well, was sort of, you know. the full experience. Yeah, not the full-fledged experience. So we've got some iced milk in the official shock shaker. Get it right now, Code Shock. 30% off starting on the 20th. <laughs> you can also actually get 30% off this flavor too on the 22nd when it comes out, which is pretty awesome. Every once in a while, G Fuel will do that where they will do 30% off on the new tubs, which is gonna be awesome. But anyways, before our ice melts in our shakers, let's go ahead and mix this up and see if we like it. So here yes, we go. Sir. The milk that we are using, I'm using original oat milk. Um, perfect so milk. Perfect yeah. Milk. So when we uh, when we had that little bit, you know, back then, when we had that little tiny bit that we tried, did you Half like it? Scoop. It was pretty good. It was among my favorite flavors I've had. Did you like it more in the milk or the water? Definitely more in the milk. If you if awesome. you get the flavor, you should definitely try it in the milk. Yeah, and I actually just had my mom try some, and she liked it a lot more in the milk as well. Coffee fan. Definitely, and she's a little strong coffee fam. Um, so milk, milk so far I've seen is the way to go. But here we go. Three, two, one. Got that powder going in there. There we go. You really gotta have a good arm. I got a great arm, especially especially my right arm. Yeah. I've had many years of experience. Max has only just started using his arm, so. Yeah, no, I, uh, and just my right, so my left just doesn't work. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it just kind of like, watches. <laughs> watches, yep. You got, a, you got a good left arm there. <laughs> I got it, yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, here we go. Man. I'm telling you, it's you like guys, foam, so look foam. at this. You, like, so you can foam. see the foam in there. Here we go, guys. The G Fuel Coffee French Vanilla with milk. Definitely recommend trying. It almost looks like um, thick, like super, super, super thick. Yeah, and you know, it's it's gonna taste different in all the milk, in all different types of milks. So, the the milk that I'm using at the moment only has about um, three grams of sugar per cup. The milk that my mom uses has like 11 grams of sugar. So every different type of milk has more sugar in it. Yep. So you're gonna get a different taste from each type of milk. So if you wanna get the taste that we're getting, um, I'll put some screenshots of the milk that I used up. So if you guys want that exact taste, but- The best milk. Yes. Oat milk. The oat milk. As long as you're not allergic to oats, that is. Yeah. <laughs> oats, nuts. Yeah, I like, I like, what's up? Oats. It's not it as like... foamy as when it's in water though. It that, gets really foamy when it's there's in water. A, I can't remember what flavor. Strawberry, banana, and uh, milk gets insanely foamy. Mm -hmm. It's bad. Yeah, but I can say right now off the bat, the coffee smell is less in the milk than it is in the water. The coffee smell in the water is way more stronger and prominent. But, all right. Yeah, no, you gotta, you gotta milk there already. Here we go. Ooh. I got a lot of foam. That's what. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a lot of foam. It almost tastes like a coffee cake milkshake. Oh, and you know, it does. <laughs> it's, it definitely tastes like a like a lighter coffee cake, for sure. Mm. I'm gonna tell you guys off the bat right now. I'm gonna tell you guys the truth right now. Spitting facts. This is amazing in milk. Is it something I'm gonna pick up on the daily and drink with water? Me personally, probably not. But in milk in the morning, I'm definitely gonna be having this. But for me personally in the water, it's not a huge winner for me. But in the milk, mm. I really actually don't. I mean, it's okay. It's like you said, it's okay in the water. Yeah. Like it's not, 
it tastes way better with the milk. Kind of adds that extra flavor to it. It just feels how it's supposed to be. Yeah, it tastes kind of like, like strawberry tastes like banana. French vanilla. Yeah, like the the oat milk and adds the more yeah. of the vanilla to the yep. French vanilla. And you've tried uh, you've tried strawberry banana milk and water, right? I haven't tried it in water. Oh, you just, haven't just milk. Oh, only milk. Wow. Yeah. It's um, that is interesting. It just tastes like a nice smoothie. Mm -hmm. like you feel healthy drinking it. Yeah. This is definitely, like you said, like a wicked morning flavor. Mm hmm Instead of, you know, gummy fish in the morning. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is totally different. It's, um... All right, guys, so the concluding answer is with milk, or specifically, oat milk. Specifically. <laughs> specifically, oat milk <laughs> is super good uh, with the G Fuel. French Top Vanilla notch. Iced Coffee. Um, now, I'm not saying it's terrible in water. I'm not saying it's bad in water. But I am saying it's better in milk. Wait a um, minute. Wait a 100%. 100%. 100%. 100. Keep it 100. So my mom likes it better in milk. I like it better in milk. Max likes it better in milk. And yeah. So I would love to hear what you guys think. Maybe when it comes out and everybody gets a chance to try it, maybe I will do a poll. And I'll ask you guys on Twitter and YouTube, do you like it better in milk or do you like it better in water? Cannot wait to hear your guys' response. Um, another thing that I would like to say is I would definitely try it in a lesser sweet milk rather than a super sweet milk. Less sugar. Yeah, less sugar content Tastes milk. Tastes better. Definitely, 100%. Um, so yeah, watch out for that, guys. Try it with milk, but try it with a less sweeter milk. Um, my mom tried it with a milk that had 11 grams of sugar per cup, and that was a little too, bit too much. This one has about three, four grams of sugar per cup. So that's what we got going on. So thank you to Max for being here, trying it out, giving you guys some extra opinions, because I know, you know, it's always nice to have some extra opinions in the video instead of just me. So thank you guys very much for watching. Be sure to use code SHOCK. I appreciate it. Tweet me if anybody uses code SHOCK on the new flavor or the shock shaker and yeah best shaker thank you yeah a lot of you i've been giving my shaker to as many people locally as i can i got um, mine and I yeah almost everybody in my town has one by now you just see everybody <laughs> walking around with one <laughs> nice yep. little glossy shock shaker. <laughs> anyways guys thank you for being in the video um thank you for max being in the video <laughs> and i will catch you guys in my next video peace out guys